Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today we're going to talk about uh, uh, what's in the news all day, every day, uh, COVID-19 and ways to uh, immune your system to protect yourself. <clears throat> uh, of course, you're careful now to avoid COVID-19 by, by staying home, uh, washing your hand, wiping down surfaces, um, but there's another way to protect yourself and your family is to prepare your immune system to fight the virus if you get infected. Think of it this way. When COVID attacks your body, it's waging a battle against you. If you don't have your armor on, uh, you will likely get wounded. While you're at home, why not start preparing your preparing and arming uh, your immune system for that attack it, if it have, uh, eventually comes. Here's a, uh, I'm gonna list uh, several ways that you can do that. First off, move your body. When you exercise, not only do, you, do your muscles get stronger, but you also prepare your cardiovascular system too. Uh, additionally, running or walking can release the chemicals that get your mood a boost, which can help you mentally as well, which is very important since we're uh, staying at home uh, and uh, uh, self-isolation. Uh, eat well. Uh, add antioxidants and immune-boosting foods uh, to your diet. Make it colorful with berries. Uh, avocados, nuts, carrots, and other veggies and fruits which give you a full plate of vitamins and minerals. And don't forget to add natural vitamin C. Uh, oranges are a great source, but so are kiwi, uh, red peppers, and tomatoes. Basically, you want colorful fruits and vegetables. They are rich in antioxidants, and they're going <clears> to... <throat> uh, uh, give your immune system a real boost. During this time or any time, it's important to get enough sleep. When you're most when you're mostly at home, there is really no reason why you can't get seven or eight hours of sleep. Sleep helps reboot your system, and it can help release uh, enzymes uh, uh, that can help the immune system fight off infections very important. Go outside if you can. Uh, since my gym is closed, uh, I work out uh, in in the driveway. I bring out all my equipment <laughs> in the driveway and wave at the neighbors across the street as I'm working out. And uh, So I'm getting the fresh air, I'm getting, I'm working out also, and then also I don't feel so isolated because I do see people walking through the neighborhood and we do speak from a distance. So very important, don't lock yourself up in the house and all day, every day. Get outside if you can. Um, if it's possible, I know this is a very stressful time, uh, decrease your stress. Stress release hormone, uh, hormones that can uh, impair your immune system. Try to take a few minutes every day to do some deep breathing or meditation. Uh, or listen to some calming music or listen to a podcast about something that you enjoy. And turn off the news. It can contribute to anxiety, especially with all that's going on. And make sure you socialize. Relationships are so important. And physical distancing does not have to mean emotional distancing. Reach out via FaceTime, Skype, or Zoom. These are different apps that you can uh, uh, communicate with your friends and family, see their faces, and talk to them. I hope this helped, and please come back to my channel. Thank you.